It's the hero of Damas. Come in, stay a while, tell me all about your adventures. I'm afraid I don't have the time. I see. Too important for me now. It's not that. No, no, of course not. How may I serve you then? Al Muallam has asked I take the life of the one they call Jubayer. Ah, Salah Adin's chief scholar. Strange choice of target, in my opinion. But who are we to question the Master's will? I'm sure he has his reasons. Then you're familiar with the man. He's been quite busy these past few days, organizing the scholars and sending them into the streets to preach. What do they speak of? Light and fire, cleansing sins, apocalyptic nonsense, if you ask me. All this talk of paths and a new world. What about this new world? Couldn't say. I don't pay attention to the ramblings of madmen. Much too busy with real work. Very well. I'll walk among the people, see what I can learn. Where would you suggest I search? South of here, you'll find an academy and a guard tower. They're both good places to search. There's also a hospital to the east you might want to visit. I'll begin at once. So eager. You've certainly changed. And for the better, I might add. Templar this morning. Well, I suppose that's actually good news. I even found a letter on him which I gave to Namayir, who said he'd find you and deliver it. But from the look in your face, I suspect this hasn't happened. Go on then. Don't waste any more time with me. Seek Namayir and get that letter. Out here, here. Take this. I've been looking everywhere for you. Now I can finally return to Masyaf. Last time I offered to do someone a favor.
Yourself from my sight. My family is sick and dying. Could you Can spare a few coins? I beg of you. I beg of you just a few coins. Please. What Please, is sir, have any money? Are you a friend of mine? No? All I ask so get is away for a few coins. <laughs> to see him, to hear him speak. It can be arranged, but we must be careful. There are still those who reject illumination. They would harm him. Then they are ignorant and afraid. You seem sincere, but how do I know I can trust you? It hurts me to even hear you ask the question. Very well. We gather each day in the madrasa. He comes to speak, and then leads us into the city that we might cleanse it. Could I join you then? Understand that it is a difficult path we walk. Our work demands sacrifice. I understand. Then come and meet with us. Let us see how strong you really are.
as you described it. I suspect he'll want to deal with this himself, and quickly. Best we say nothing to the others. A wise course of action. Truth be told, I'll be happy when this business is done. Soon, my friend, soon. Today should see the last of them put to torch. Boy, come here. You still have the letter I gave you? Yes. Go and deliver it then. You'll find the one it's meant for inside the madrasa. That city is ours, has always been ours. And it is our duty to defend it until death. The crusaders must be destroyed. So comes the English king and his infidel army. They leave horrors in their wake. Slipping away. I'll be you, my friend. You have become quite the wanted man, as am I. I must prepare my family for the trip back to the safety of Masayef this afternoon. Could you finish my last assignment in exchange for information? Some men must be eliminated in Jubair's quarter. Be fast, my friend. Just a little money, I beg of you. All I ask is for a Found 
the strength to stand in defense of our great civilization. You want something? Make no mistake. Uh, 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 what do you want? Surrounded by false knowledge, created by wicked men who seek dominion over your minds. Locked away, they might still be discovered. But once more... A few coins. All I ask is for a few coins. No, you don't understand. I have nothing. Please, can't you spare something? I'm poor and sick and hungry. I don't understand what you're trying Away with the film! Someone tell me why he's doing that. Going to cause trouble. No, please don't leave. Please, just a few points. Stop me. I'm poor and sick and hungry. I'm so hungry. What is he doing? Pray for your sins. You are against the will of God. It must be made to pay. Everywhere they rise, they see only suffering in their wake. They say it is a good thing. I'll take you down! This won't be too difficult. Could you spare a few coins? I beg of you. <laughs> He's going to hurt himself. What is he doing? When he does, I won't help him. made clear to Jubayer. He saw what must be done. Understood it fell to him, having learned the truth, to spread it. And as he was shown the way, so was I. And I will show you as well. 
Kubayer sees things the way they truly are, sees the poison you carry in your hearts and minds, he works to cast it out. Remove all texts from your homes and schools. Give them to us. They must be destroyed. Is that right to move? That's the only thing. Violence is not the answer, my child. In this we agree, so speak and I may stay my blade. What is it your master intends? Why destroy all this knowledge? We lay the stones to build a road upon which soon all men will travel. It leads to a better tomorrow. That is not what I see. Then you are blind. The words upon these parchments, they are poison. Jubayer holds the cure. He'll free us from their lies. It's nonsense you speak. You've lost your mind. No, not lost, but found. I see the world for what it truly is. He has shown me so much. I am illuminated. The fanatic is all you are, and dangerous for it. Do what you must. It changes nothing. We are not afraid. You should be. What's this? Oh, the mighty. Who did this? No. What happened? A few points. All I ask is for a few points. Away with you. You shouldn't be here. Be gone. Your mind 
family. It's great to see you back so quickly and in one piece. I must return to my family, but before I leave, this is for you. I found a map showing where scholars are planning to burn books and other sources of knowledge. Please be careful and let the future reunite us. I'll give your blessings to my family. What do you want? Help me! I'll Be here. Be oh. going with you. Huh? 
Show yourself. Tragic. If you need me, I'll You're be a good man for having help. Hello, my friend. Oh, I might have to pay the favor. You should have kept your hands to yourself. Someone stop. God! See! You can't escape! Now! Oh, you must not 
No further. Away. He's gone mad. What are you He's hurting. Get a rejection. سوف أنبهك إذا رأيته يمر بالجوار. لن يبعد كثيرا. Ah! <laughs> 
توقف عن الجري لن تهرب بيت فاركن ديز انا ما يا Altai, your name is on everybody's lips these days, and for once their words are kind. If you're truly a changed man, perhaps you'd be willing to do me a favor. Jubair has employed certain merchants to spy on the citizens for him. They feed him names in exchange for gold. You'd be doing all the city a great service if you were to find these merchants and destroy their stalls. This should end their evil. Would anyone help me? Good thing today, Altair. In exchange, I'll share my knowledge with you. Your target is likely to be dressed much like his followers. So here is how to distinguish him from the others. He wears rich golden robes and carries with him a large pouch. Find him, brother. Make him feel pain.
another minute and they would have made off with me. I owe you my feet. What are you doing? Move! Yeah. Get away from me! I'll have your head! Out of the way! I'm running! You cannot miss me! What are you doing? Move! We must end this before it has a chance to begin. Time to die. It is our time to die. Always been ours. And it is our duty to defend it until death. What news, Altair? I've learned much about my enemy. Share what you know, then. Jubayer has become obsessed with purging the city of its knowledge. A most terrible crime. Now I see why al Mualim wants you to remove him. He's using the city scholars to assist him. They go out into the streets, harassing the people and collecting all their written works. I fear he intends to destroy them all. He must be stopped. That's why I'm here. He's to hold a meeting soon, at the Madrasa al Qalasa. It's where I'll go. It's where I'll take his life. I'll leave you alone to prepare. Bring glory to the Brotherhood. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one. Every single text in this city must be destroyed. My friend, you must not do this. Much knowledge rests within these parchments, put there by our ancestors for good reason. And what reason is this? They are beacons, meant to guide us, to save us from the darkness that is ignorance. No, these bits of paper are covered in lies. They poison your minds, and so long as they exist, you cannot hope to see the world the way it truly is. How can you accuse these scrolls of being weapons? They are tools of learning. You turn to them for answers and salvation. You rely more upon them than yourselves. This makes you weak and stupid. You trust in words, drops of ink. Do you ever stop to think of who put them there? Or why? No. You simply accept their words without question. And what if those words speak falsely, as they often do? This is dangerous. You are wrong. These texts give the gift of knowledge. We need them. You love your precious writings. You do anything for them? Yes. Uh, yes, of course. Then join them! Ah! Ah! Any man who speaks as he is just as much a threat. Do any else among you wish to challenge me? Good. Your orders are simple enough. Go out into the city. Collect any remaining writings and add them to the piles in the streets. 
When you're done, we'll send a cart to collect them, that they may be destroyed.
be free to do what they believe. It is not our right to punish one for thinking what they do, no matter how much we disagree. Then what? You of all people should know the answer. Educate them. Teach them right from wrong. It must be knowledge that frees them, not force. They do not learn, fixed in their ways as they are. You are naive to think otherwise. It's an illness for which there is but one cure. You're wrong. And that's why you must be put to rest. Am I not unlike those precious books you seek to save? A source of knowledge with which you disagree, yet you are rather quick to steal my life. A small sacrifice to save many. It is necessary. Is it not ancient scrolls that inspire the Crusaders? That fill Salah ad and his men with a sense of righteous fury? Their texts endanger others, bring death in their wake. I, too, was making a small sacrifice. It matters little now. Your deed is done. And so am I. Jubayer, tell me you've met with success. Yes. Jubayer's fires are extinguished. His life as well. 
excellent news. I had no doubt you'd succeed. You should have seen it. The scholars followed him so readily. It wasn't just books they fed to fire either, but any man who opposed them. Such ignorance breeds only evil. You've done a good thing this day. As with my other targets, he believed he was doing the right thing, clearing a path to a better future. Of course he would. Such is the landscape of a madman's mind. The things I've seen these past few weeks, it's as if all the land has gone mad. And this is why we fight to end the war, that sanity might return. The people are desperate for direction. It's easy for men like Jubayer to prey on this and turn them towards evil. You should go, Altair. Return to Al Mualim. Tell him what you saw. Let him know the good you've done this day. Safety and peace, Rafi. Upon you as well. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. taken care of. I want that progress report by tomorrow morning. I've got some work I need to do. So you've got the rest of the night to yourself. I think there's a problem with the Animus. Nope. It's working fine. I'm pretty sure it just ejected me I'm when I... I'm pretty sure you should shut up. You ready to finally tell me what's going on? We have to stop them, Desmond. When they access that last memory of yours, they're just getting started. They want to change everything. The way we live, the way we think, the way we are. You've gotten the lecture from Vidic about what's wrong with the world, how we need order and discipline, so they're going to give it to us. Only we don't have a say in the matter. How? The Templar treasure. They think it... Miss Stillman? I'm here. I need you to upload Desmond's files to the database. Got it. So what? You're using me to find this Templar treasure? What do they call it? The Peace of Eden? Yes. Well, it's looking like it's at Messiah. So I don't know why they're wasting all this time with me. Why don't they just send their people to pick it up? They can't. It's not that simple. The artifact from Messiah, they had it. It was destroyed in the accident. Then what are they hoping for me? You know, for my ancestor to tell them? They're hoping he'll show them where the other ones are. You mean there's more than one of these things? Oh, Desmond, you have no idea. Is there a problem, Miss No, Stillman? Warren. Everything's Denver on my end. Then, where are the files? I've got to move these files before he gets suspicious. We'll talk more later.
Time's wasting, Mr. Miles. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. We're nearly done, you know. And then what? You'll see. Maybe they'll even let you watch when it begins. It's not as terrible as you think. Look, I know you're not gonna let me leave. So why not tell me what's going on? Humor me. I'm not an idiot, Mr. Miles. I think you've already learned quite a bit. I don't know what you're talking about. Of course not. All right, let me ask you something else then. Yes? Some of the stuff I'm seeing in the Animus, sometimes it seems wrong. Untrue, like the history is off somehow. It doesn't... It doesn't what, Mr. Miles? Match up with what you read on an online encyclopedia? What your high school history teacher taught you? Let me ask you something. Do these supposed experts have access to secret knowledge, kept hidden from the rest of us? There are books, letters, documents, all sorts of source material from back then. Some of it seems to contradict what the Animus is showing me. Anyone can write a book, and they can put whatever they want on its pages. Anything. <laughs> Used to be we thought the world was flat. Some people still do. Yes, and they publish books about it. Or that the moon landing was a hoax. I believe there's also a book claims the world was created in seven days. A bestseller, too. Where's this going, Doc? The point, I suppose, is that you shouldn't trust everything you hear, everything you read. What's that your ancestors said? Nothing is true? Everything is permitted. Yes, exactly. It's part of what makes the Animus so spectacular. There's no room for misinterpretation. There's always room. Touché, Mr. Miles. Now that I've answered your question, can we begin? Thank you. 